Hey everybody, today I'm really excited to introduce you guys to this product here. Inside of this cool little carrying case here is an electronic hydraulic jack. It's really, really purposeful. It's got a couple different functions. It's not only a jack, but it's also got an LED light and it is also a tire inflator. So what's nice about this is the size and how compact it is. You can actually leave this in your car and bring it with you and jack up your car if you have any troubles on the side of the road. It's got everything that you need in here to accomplish some really, really awesome tasks. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up, show you guys what this looks like. What I like about this is that it's nice and compact, and so it fits in this place. And as you guys can see, it's got everything that you need inside of here. It comes with some gloves, a couple fuses here. And lots of little tools. Very, very helpful. And as you guys can see, what's nice about this is that this plugs right into a 12 volt outlet inside of your car. So this would go right into your cigarette outlet here. And then also you can plug this into directly to the battery if you need to as well. So this is the actual pump itself. It's nice and big and heavy duty, 12 volt. As you guys can see, this is the hydraulic jack here. So you can actually power this on and it'll jack up the car right here from this little spot. As you can see, it's got this giant LED here as well. And so there are a couple different buttons and some gauges here as well that I wanna point out. It has an up, a stop, and a down button. So jacking it up, jacking it down, stopping in the middle. This is gonna be for your tire gauge here. So this shows your PSI. And then it also has a light switch here. And then this additional button here, which we'll get into in a second. On the back side, you'll see that it does have these little emergency lights. So when you are on the side of the road, this is really going to protect you, you know, in an emergency situation, especially if you're out in the dark. So, and then here you can see that it also says air. So if you've got a flat tire, you can use this since it is a air compressor, you can use this to actually fill the air in your tires. So if you open this up, you can see that it does have this little valve stem here. This can plug right into your tires and you can operate it to fill air. it is all in one little spot. This side opens up here as well and you'll see that it does have a couple tools inside of here so it's got a couple fuses, a couple nozzles here, and then a little allen wrench there as well. All right and just to go over this a little bit better with closer detail here this is going to be your switch panel so I'll get into that in a second. Uh, additionally it'll have your storage boxes on each side one for the air hose and one for like I showed you here before with the little fuses. And then on the other side here is gonna be for the air hose. And then you'll also have the actual pressure rod, which is right here. So this is what is used to lift up the car. And then of course you have the LED here in the front. What's also cool is that it also has this little LED right here that points up so that way you can actually see what you're lifting underneath the car. So not only from the front here, but also from the top. And as you can see, it does have this little protective pad here with the grooves. So this will line up directly with the uh, side of the car on the jacking point. And what's great is that you can use this on passenger vehicles, you can use this on an ATV, on a truck, and so you know each car is a different height. And so you can actually adjust the height here by spinning this first, getting it to where you need it to be to, so that it's close to the bottom of the car, and then you can turn it on and it'll jack up from there. And so for the switches here, this is going to be your switch panel. So this is gonna be a direction switch. So this is gonna be up, close, and down. Once again, this is gonna be your pressure gauge. So this is gonna show your PSI here. This next switch here is going to be a function gauge. And so this will inflate, close, and lift. So if you wanted to toggle between lifting the car with this, you'll have it here. If you want to have it close, you'll have it here. And then this button here will be for inflating tires. And so you can toggle between those two functions. And then here is going to be a light switch on and off. And then once again here in the kit, you'll see that it's got some gloves, a couple extra fuses here. And then it also comes with this really cool glass brake tool here. So on the front here, pull this off. You'll see that it's got this really sharp tip here. So this is for breaking glass. 
So also a little hammer here and a small little razor knife here on the bottom. All right, just to show you guys how easy this is to operate here, I'm gonna lift this up. So what I'm gonna do is plug this side into the 12 volt outlet here. Make sure that's plugged in. You'll see a little red light, LED light here that indicates that we have power. And then on this other side here, I'll take this end, plug it right in. It only goes in one direction here, just like so. And you'll see that we've got power to it because the little lights here on the back side are lighting up. So really nice for emergency purposes. And then what we're gonna do is here on the front, you can see we've got the LED lights on here. Turn those both off, turn it back on, just from the hit of the switch there. And then what I'm going to do is line this up underneath the car, exactly on the jack point, and then we'll turn it on. Alright, and just so you can see what I'm doing here, I'm lining this up to the jack point indicator. I'm going to turn this knob until I get it to where I need it to be, right up against the car. And I'm going to put it right onto the groove. And then I'm going to go ahead and turn the ignition on, and then we're going to turn this up. Alright, so I've got the car in accessory mode. You can hit this up button here. very quiet and as you can see it lifted it up just with the hydraulic there and now we've got the tire completely off the ground here so as you can see it's lifted this high off the ground and then so once we you know repair our wheel or whatever we need to do I can hit this button it'll go back down Just open this side up here, pull this little valve out here, and then we can attach it here to the car itself, to the wheel. And so, this is very simple to use, as you can see. And this will just screw right on in its place, just like that. And then now what we need to do is toggle, you can tell it already sensed how much pressure was in the tire, so now we need to toggle this switch here. All right guys, so super, super awesome kit to have. This is such a great item here. Makes a really great gift as well, and this is you know a nice thing to have in your car and having it nice and small and compact, and it does so many different things. Makes this the perfect item for you guys. So highly recommend this product, super easy to use, and I hope you enjoyed this review.